An East Bay garbage company is making the case to issue fines to residents who recycle but do it the wrong way. Our Building a Better Bay Area reports pointed out that the company had no prior authority to issue these citations, but that could change after tonight's city council meeting in Richmond. ABC 7 News reporter Kate Larson joins us there live. Kate? Well, Larry, the meeting is still going on and Republic Service is presenting to Richmond City Council right now and saying that they want to continue inspecting their customers recycling and issuing fines. In December, seven on your side's Michael Finney reported that West Contra Costa County Garbage and Recycling Company Republic Services was fining customers for recycling incorrectly. Residents showed us bills for $26 for having contaminated materials in their recycling. These people had no idea what they did wrong or how to correct the alleged recycling error. The city of Richmond issued a cease and desist letter requesting that Republic Services stop citing customers and refund the money they collected from fines. Tonight, Republic Services is presenting at Council. They say that international recycling material buyers, like China, are now rejecting contaminated loads. They say that garbage, like dirty diapers, kitty litter, food scraps, clothing, e-waste, and construction debris is being disposed of in the recycling bins. Republic Services says the contamination level for West Contra Costa County ranges between 15 and 45 percent. So Republic Services gave three options tonight. Option one, which is their preference, is to continue cart audits with a fine of $27.75 and a notice with the type of contamination. Option two would be to audit, tag, and leave the cart unserviced to deal with the following week, which they say could be more costly to customers. And option three is to do nothing, which they say could result in $10,000 fines from the state to communities who don't recycle enough of their waste. Our public services actually tells me that our reporting has been helpful about getting the word out about what they're calling a recycling crisis. And they say, don't be surprised if your garbage and recycling company starts inspecting your trash and issuing fines. 